For this video, we will be finding the value of x of the following scenario here. So what we have going on here is we have a transversal that's cutting through two parallel lines. So when this situation happens, it forms some relationships that we have going on here. So when we look at this image, specifically we're trying to find the value of x. And we see that we have an angle here and we have an angle here. These two angles, notice that they're on alternate sides of our transversal, right? One's on this side, one's on this side. So that gives us a relationship of being alternate. And then these inside angles inside here in between the two parallel lines, right? These angles here are called the inside angles. On the outside over here, well, they're outside angles. So these two angles that we're looking at, they're alternate interior angles because they're on the inside here. And what we know about alternate interior angles is that they're equal to each other. And that's the important bit in order to solve this problem. These two angles here will be equal to each other, again, because they're alternate interior angles. So this angle equals this angle, just like in a similar situation, this angle over here would equal this angle over here because they're also alternate but interior angles. So we just need to set these equal to each other and solve the equation that we get from doing that. So this angle up here is a 2x minus 24 and we're going to set that equal to the other angle which is 90. Solve this equation. In order to solve this equation we're going to add that 24 over to the other side canceling the 24 on the left giving us 2x is equal to 114. Divide out that coefficient, so we're dividing by 2, and x is equal to, what is that, a 57 there. So x is equal to 57 degrees. So finding the value of x, x is equal to 57 degrees. If we want to find the actual value over here, what well should equal 90? This is equal to 90. This is equal to 90. We can definitely plug in the uh, 57 here for this x and do 2 times 57 minus 24, which will also calculate to 90 degrees.